Welcome to the world of Spanglish Gaming. Hi there guys, it's Fumpane, and I am here today to bring you guys yet another tutorial in Sony Vegas. Today I am teaching you guys on how to make a magnifying glass effect thing-ish in Sony Vegas. And I do know for a fact it will work with 10, 11 and 12 Vegas. Probably previous version as well, but I'm not too sure because I haven't worked with those programs personally. But basically what you need is some kind of footage footage and a plugin called Cookie Cutter which should be in every it's in from standard basically. And uh, I'm gonna be working with this thumbnail I have for this episode. And yeah. Keep please keep in mind I'm still new to this whole plugin so um track motion motion tracking even so bear with me but hopefully this will teach you guys uh, on, uh, how to make a nice looking effect and all that so let's get started uh, here's my thumbnail here's my footage and I'm gonna I'm gonna start out by duplicating the track there we go and now I'm going down here to impress this little button which is, which is track motion and I'm just gonna pull and drag from the corner so it zooms in a bit and uh, now you're gonna go to vi video effects and down to cookie cutter and you wanna select the circle center option and just drag it on top the first uh, top one and as you can see now in the preview window we have a circle that zooms in um, and to make it look a bit more like a magnifying glass I'm gonna give it a border and I'm going for a white border since I have a black background 07 should be alright well 007 and I'm gonna decrease the size of the circle and I'm gonna move around it a bit alright so now we have a uh, now we have a magnifying circle glass thingy here comes the tricky part, which I am still horrible with, so hopefully you guys will be doing way better than I am, but this is just for education purposes, so yeah. Whatever we want to do now is make, sh uh, depending on if you have window, uh, Windows Vegas 12, I'm not sure how it is in the level, level. but anyway, if you have Vegas 12, you want to press this button on the center section otherwise it will go all wrong which says animate uh, if you don't have these buttons it should be a button underneath this big box which says uh, animate so just go in there and here we're gonna make keyframes so basically what we want to do is go forward a bit and move this to where you want them oops that didn't go as planned there we go. All right. So basically, just look where the crosshair is and uh, move it around to where you want it to go. And uh, I think you could do quite awesome effects with this type of effect, uh, especially with intros and what now. All right. So. Now we have something going on at least. Let's take a look. All right, all right, yeah, a bit quick, but yeah, especially down there, really speed it on. All right, so uh, here's the footage. I mean, a bit bad, but at least it does what it's supposed to. It magnifies, and you could of course change the size, uh, the magnifying size at any time yes just, just go in here again and drag and reduce to whatever you want but let's say you want it to magnify that much you want to go back into cookie cutter and sh decrease the size even more maybe even the border a bit all right that was a bit too low all right 
Uh, so now it should be even bigger. Yep. Uh, so yeah, that was the magnifying glass effect. And I uh, hope you guys liked it. And I think you guys should do a video response to this one and show me your work with it. And um, if I see some responses, I will do the same. I will do put some more work into it and see what I can make up. And even if I, ha I might even do an intro for someone's channel if they request it on this particular video. Uh, but yeah, if this video helped you in any way, I would like for you to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't. It would also be really nice if you left a comment on this particular video or uh, if you have any suggestions, suggestions, sorry for my bad English, uh, for upcoming videos I should do. And yeah, I think that's about it for this uh, tutorial. So as always, Vikings out.